excellent work. The virus program, the one that was hidden within her mind, it was the only thing that ever posed a threat to me. But now that we have her, she is no longer a menace, and there are no other obstacles left to stand in my way. Therefore, Rion, I command you to kill the girl now. Is this your final command for me, Mother? Rion! This isn't the first time you and I have met. Over and over, we meet inside this program you left behind. Rion, what do you mean? Not the first, but it will be the last. The eyes! Oh my god! Fire! Fire! Ah! No, I wasn't standing in a good place. Very bad place. Ooh, fire again! Ooh, evil eyes! Oh, she died! Awesome! And I didn't die! Haha! <laughs> Welcome to six years in the future. Nudity! Lilia? Welcome back, Rion. This is going to hurt a bit. You've been getting regular pulse stimulation, so your muscles shouldn't have atrophied. Was that a little? Good. I can move them. That's a relief. When you had a brain crash and died, I immediately put your body into this cryogenic device. So that's what happened. I always believed that someday there'd be a way to revive you. 
Okay. Get your clothes on, then we'll talk. Why has he been lying so, naked? What the hell went on while I was sleeping? Since that day, mankind has been at war with the last Galarian they call Ash. The last Galarian? Ash? Just before Dorothy's system was destroyed by the virus, she started a final program. A program that would create the last Galarian, one designed to eliminate all mankind and also serve to resurrect her. Ash's power is horrifying. His body is an out-of-control atomic reactor, and he can make it go critical, scattering neutron rays and radioactivity all around. Are we in a fallout shelter now? Yes. Michelangelo City. It's already in ruins, and no one lives here anymore. We found this place seven days ago. It's our base for fighting Ash. It's a shelter converted from an air terminal. The army is protecting it, so we're safe for now. But if Ash gets in, then nothing will save us. Is there no way to destroy him? Only one. You must inject the virus program from your brain into his. The virus that destroyed Dorothy will also work on Ash. Unfortunately, it's taken years to find that out. Arabesque, rabbits, battle robots, they all obey the last Galarian. The army provided us with all kinds of enemy corpses which we used for research. Eventually, we discovered that all of the DNA created by Dorothy has the same concealed trap. Trap? Yes. A genetic system abnormality that even Dorothy couldn't fix. So it's like... Yes. It's like a self-destruct switch to attack with the virus program. The last hope that our fathers left for us. However, six years ago, we lost the virus program when we lost you. I continued the research so that we could recreate the virus, but it was impossible. Even though we understood it, we couldn't recreate it. But then I noticed that a small amount of power was being supplied to the destroyed mushroom tower. The power was being sent from an enriched uranium refining factory, Ash's base. There had to be something important there. I went up through the mushroom tower, but I couldn't get past the complex, intricate guard program. I passed my information onto the army. After that, I could only place my faith in the hope that their computers would be able to breach the program. And just as I'd hoped, they were able to get past it. And it was there that we found the backup data for the family program. And that's where you found me? That's right. Eventually, in the vastness of the backup data left by Dorothy, I somehow managed to find you. Rion. You realize that there is only one who can defeat a child of Dorothy. Yes, I know. A child of Dorothy. Rian. This tragic battle should only be mine, and mine alone. I know. They're here. Come with me. The control room is down below. Oh, now you guys know what happened. <laughs> Ooh, a save point. I think it is.